So we got here a little, maybe 15, 20 minutes earlier than yesterday. And it's about five minutes till legal light. And we're just glassing in this first field and not much yet. I'm gonna check the wind here and we're probably gonna hang out in this first field. We saw a buck, a couple small does yesterday right off the bat, but just scanning here, I don't see anything yet uh, moving. So we're gonna give this field a little shot and then we're gonna mosey on over to that second field and see what's going on there if we don't see any action in the first probably half an hour here.
bunch of deer. They've been going up the ridge and coming down the ridge. There's a doe down low here, probably 100 yards. And now there's two bucks on the ridge. But the hard part is we're close to the boundary of the other, uh, other rancher's property. But, I mean, we had that doe and fawn come at us this way, then go out the field that way, so I know we're in a, we're in a good spot. Well, the uh, original plan was to get here early-ish, and based on what we saw yesterday, <clears throat> they were coming downhill from the pivot ranch fields above, and we saw two come through here, and I was hoping that would happen again, but we basically just watched for the last two hours deer just paralleling the property boundary on the opposite side of the fence. And at one point we saw six together, so yeah, I think we're going to try a new uh, new hunting spot the next time we go out. Um, got some stuff to do tonight, so unfortunately we can't come back out in the evening. And like what we did yesterday I don't think was the best idea. Michael brought up that we were in a spot all afternoon, kind of just waiting it out for the evening. And the wind was swirling all day, and basically he said that we were basically just broadcasting our smell all around the area for the deer. So it's probably better to get out in the afternoon because down in this valley we just had swirling wind pretty much all day yesterday and today. So rather than sitting around waiting again all afternoon in the sun, um, we're gonna get out of here and leave these deer alone. Maybe we'll come back here, but I think we'll probably try a new spot and maybe use a ground blind and try a different technique. But learned a lot and uh, gonna see what we can see on the, the way back to the truck. All right, so it's 10.30, it's getting pretty warm. Uh, we're not gonna do what we did yesterday and just sit still and let our scent swirl all over the place. So Michael and I have to do some work. Um, Michael and I have to get some work stuff done tonight, so we unfortunately can't come back um, tonight to this property, but we've got one or two more hunts planned. We might try some public, maybe a different piece of private. Maybe we'll come back here if I get permission to come back here. Um, but yeah, learned a lot so far and looking forward to the next time. Mm -hmm.